Welcome back to Let's Play Spyro the Dragon Reignited. I'm Burning Dog Face, and that rabbit didn't stop there until just before I started recording, so I guess he just wanted to crash the video. Speaking of which, mission accomplished, little guys. Uh, I incinerated all those uh, norks behind me and got their gems. Uh, sorry, their orbs. And now, I'm going to incinerate all the, or the norks in front of me. And do the same thing. Excellent. I need one more. Are you an orc? No. You're an orc. Hell yeah. Well, at least I'm not the one infinitely drowning. Can I shoot the balloon with the cannon? I really shouldn't. Oh, uh, let's check out Clifftown before I get the uh, desire for more destruction. I really like that both sides of the portal bring you to the same place. That's better. Whoa, Spyro, that was a big one. Is that guy wearing a metal poncho? Well, metal means I should charge him, right? That was a metal cape. That's the worst bullfighter I've ever seen. Although making it fireproof was a nice start. Making the sparkles bigger from further away was very clever, by the way. Oh, the sand isn't supposed to do that. I'm not going down there. Yeah, it's just right here. Shame, there's an infinite desert to explore out there. Okay. And it does kind of bring to mind the fact that, uh, so far, uh, all of the dragons I've rescued kind of make it seem like the species is a sausage party. But, uh, I feel like that's probably not the case due to simple logistics. Uh oh. Wait, I didn't actually get hit. Oh, neat. Clifftown, is there one here? Just checking, you know, it's important to know. Okay. I will check the other page, what the hell? Okay, good. Nothing started to see. Oh. No, oh, it's those, uh, yeah, 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 frilled lizards. Are these ones that, like, shoot blood from their eyes to drive off predators? Oh, there were two of them. That's very sneaky. Egg thief! Man, that's somebody's kid. Yeah, now you can deal with a sandy cloud, asshole. Hey, sorry about that. I just wanted to make sure I got, you know, the young one taken care of. Palvor. 
How's a dragon supposed to flame metal armor anyway? Remember, Spyro, flame won't work on metal, but charging with your horns, that should do the trick. I wonder if they were this insistent on uh, telling me things that have already been told to me the first time around. I mean, I guess technically you don't have to touch any of them. You could have just continued on your way. Well, I guess you do need a certain amount of them in order to get to the second world. But you know what I mean. It does feel a bit odd to repeat them to this level, though. These orange norks don't seem to be any more fearsome than the green ones did. Uh, were, I guess I should say. Green ones were. Oh, right, that's not Hadeal with the fat, uh, large ones. <clears throat> Uh, I didn't exactly brain that properly, but you know. At least I didn't get hurt. Well, there's that. Even though that was the one that was worth two currency, that's not, you know, great. Since from what I can tell, the dragons never spend it on anything. Oh, did I not kill you? I guess I must have just wandered off. Toasty! There. It's not the right pitch. I'm not sure I can physically reach the right pitch. Steve. That's about as close as I can manage it. See, I said that and then immediately thought to myself, well, no, that just sounds like a challenge, me. Nah, I'm just kidding, I'm fine. I like that. Oh, oh, firework. Oh, I almost made it without gliding. Just a nice flying leap. Come on! Grumble, grumble, grumble. Uh oh! Walking around while holding the uh, the trigger that makes the thing center behind you is uh, not advised. Let's say. Wait, how the fuck am I meant to get over... Oh, there's a whole bunch of stuff over there. All right. Oh, it's actually just... You know, God rays. Neat. And so not Zoro disintegrated, because he kind of sucked. Got a little bit anxious there because I couldn't see myself and didn't know if I was about to be murdered or not. Soup's on! I mean, I've seen worse soup, to be sure. Oh, yeah. 
Hang on. Still haven't figured out how these work yet. Did you see that? It was baller! Enzo. Hey, what's on the other side of that river? Why don't you glide there and find out? That guy seemed to have either gems or minerals stuck to his face like a beard. Is that a natural phenomenon? if they had names in the original. My understanding is that they, uh, the, the thing with every dragon having a unique model is new. I'm not sure if they had individual names originally. No, it's a shortcut to the exit. That doesn't look any less silly from uh, the side than below, but you know. I'm up here now. Well, I guess I can probably glide from here. Uh, mistakes were made. Not drowning in oil. The capitalist's irony. Oh yeah, I see. There's an actual bridge over there. Right! Okay. Wait, that's where I came from, isn't it? Up here, then? I mean, that is where the guy was. Ooh, that was close. It was very close. Textures are slowly eating these rocks. It actually made me a little bit nervous. I thought he was gonna, like, fly over the flames and hit me. What am I doing for gems? Not bad, not bad. Let me guess, this is the Nork's equivalent of those, uh, crystal barriers. Well, damn it, now they're weirdly adorable in their freaky kind of way. Must you make me love all the food? I read once, like years and years ago, that dragons are supposed to be born in like big releases where it's like, oh, a thousand eggs all hatched at once, so a thousand dragons have been born today. But they don't get born the rest of the year, and Spyro is unique because he was born out of turn. I say the rest of the year, but we're talking, you know, very long lifespan, so they go for. Well, the, impl the impression I got at the time was that no dragons had been born since Spyro. Like, he was way out of turn. Like, he was, like, the other, uh... Like, the newborns are supposed to become adults before newborns... Before more newborns get born. I made that unnecessarily confusing. Whoa. You've reached the highest point in Clifftown. You can get to almost anywhere from here. If I were you... I'd use that whirlwind over there. So who else noticed that his wings were metal and mechanical? There's a story there. 
Thank you, Marco. Delicious. Huh. If it had been me, I would have put those on uh, a wall over there, and I would have had a Nork clinging to the statue with a crowbar, like, doing an animation like he's trying to pry the crystals out. Uh, those reliefs there, with a big crystal in the chest. Oh, don't mind if I do. Right, it's some kind of magic thing. It's not an updraft, I just stand on it. <laughs> They've also done a, uh, a release very similar to this concept for the first three games in the uh, Crash Bandicoot series. But to be honest, I was never nearly as interested in that one as in Spyro. I guess it was, uh... Well, I don't know, it just struck me as, you know, more of the same, is what I'm thinking. Gems do I have? Uh, all but 60. And I got the egg and all the dragons. So where the fuck are the last monies? Oh, right. Chests. I also want to know what the deal with that is. I can make that. There's a gem just over there. Snake. Fire snake. Well, that's silly. Uh, fire snake ro uh, fireworks aren't rocket launchers. Rocket launchers? They're not rockets. They're uh, those things you light and then they make like a coil of ash on the ground. They're not terribly exciting. Motherfucker. I actually thought about that as a joke to myself at one point, but it seemed too stupid to repeat out loud. Oh, maybe that's the key. Okay, I guess you just need to find some artillery back in the other level. Oops. I was meant to hit continue, not the other thing. Oh, I can do that. I can get up there. Those ones over there are only worth one each. Huh. Now everyone is burned. Together! Oh, huh. Brought me up higher, and then I glided down the last little bit. Let me see if there's anything up there. I'm guessing there is not nothing up there. What? No, I'm guessing there is not something up there. The opposite of what I wanted to say, me. Uh, all right. I know it's not you guys. Cause you're not trying to hurt me. They don't have any front legs. 
That's weird. That reminds me, I do appreciate that the dragons in this game have four limbs and a uh, pair of wings. Proper dragon should. I've seen a lot of times where people try to pass it off a dragon as something with two le back legs and two front limbs that are both legs and wings. You know, like a bat. Except that, uh, there is a specific mythological creature with that description. That's not a dragon, that's a wyvern. They're much smaller than dragons, they don't usually have a breath weapon, but they do like meat. So, you know, it's still dangerous. Just not as cool. I haven't seen any sparkles in a while. Uh huh. I am doing fairly well here, as it happens. So, uh. I guess I'll just jump in here call it an episode. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you on the next episode of Let's Play Spyro the Dragon Reignited! When we, uh, continue kicking ass, taking names, saving the dragon species. Later.